What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Nubbins Inc. Plays Albino Lullaby. My name is Eric, also known as the Great Chi Unit, and uh, I've played this game before, uh, but I ran into Jack and Justin over at Ape Law Studios, and they hooked me up with an advanced copy of this game. Uh, it's coming out in just a couple of days, so depending on when this video gets up, it'll either be out in a day or already be out. Um, now, for those of you who didn't watch this the first time we streamed it, Albino Lullaby is a game, it's a horror survival game that it, there's no blood, there's no gore, it, it's all about just being unnerving and, and, and playing on sort of your imagination and, and your fears. Uh, so we're going to get right into this. Uh, like I said, are you sure? Yeah, of course. Um, <clears throat> like I said, I already played this game once through. Um, it is... Ooh, they changed up the font. I that Now that's the one thing I want to bring up. I played this before, but Justin said that things have changed since the last time I played them. Well, I set the house on fire, clearly. This is totally different. Okay. Um, <clears throat> now this game is uh, VR enabled. It is made natively to support the Oculus Rift, uh, Eve, and um, the PlayStation Morpheus. Um, <clears throat> and I did get to play this on the Oculus Rift, and it is just absolutely unnerving on the rift um so part of me is is really apprehensive because i already know i think i think i already know how a lot of this opening section is going to go um but you know at the same time i i believe in justin's ability to to trick me into into rushing into a situation that i'm not familiar with uh so that might actually Getting the fuck out of there. Oh my god. That was exciting. Um, yeah, so the other really cool thing about this game is that, as you can see, parts of the the mansion or wherever I am, they rotate and they shift and, and things are, you know, things move around that aren't, uh, family only, that's different. Uh, things move around that you don't expect them to. damage head uh and yeah so like i said i've i've played through some parts of this game already um the graphic styling is is only better than even the last time that i uh that i played it hopefully you're reading this because uh, i'm just kind of gonna kind of rush through this section because i think i remember oh maybe not oh, is this the chair yeah there's the chair Softly, nice. They are all our children, no matter their age. Be gentle. Okay. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, the, the graphical styling of this is really, really cool. Um, you know, it's there's a lot there's a lot to look at. Uh, yeah, okay, we've seen that one before. Oh, that door is locked now. Okay, so I believe we did this. Tilts. There we go. Down. Okay, so far so familiar. Up to the gear, yep. Close that one. Alright, key's still in the same place. So, sorry if I'm kind of rushing through. If you want to, you can go back. Um, I'll link it in the description, but we did, uh, Kelsey and I did play through this level before. Um, when we were streaming in preparation for Fig, uh, which actually just happened this weekend. It was a lot of fun. Our glorious elder siblings. 
Buck. Okay, Buck is a is a guy that we we see later on, I think. Uh, okay, okay. I remember just ruining those chairs the last time. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we we streamed this in preparation for Fig uh, last year, this time last year, and had a really really good time with it. And um, what the hell is that? Me? Did that hit me in the head? Ow! Anyone caught peeping at the ascension from here will be gravely punished. Telling on friends good, earns good behavior cards. That's nice. That one's locked. Okay. <clears throat> Jesus. What is that noise? Um. Let's see if these are. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm already lost. <laughs> I think it was down here. Yeah, it was down here. Yeah, this is right. Okay. So, again, sorry if I'm rushing through this. Um, I want to get to the new stuff, you know? Up the elevator. Uh, oh, so this game is uh, going to be, or is already, depending on when this goes up, uh, live on Steam. Uh, I believe the first episode is going to be ten dollars, uh, or oh, whoa, lost focus for a little bit there. Come on, there we go. Oh, that painting is so creepy. Every time that painting is so creepy. Oh look, there's the key. Awesome, and that's. <laughs> Our first look at one of the grandchildren. Okay, so, um... The first episode of this game is going to be out on Steam. I think it'll be $10 on Steam. Or you can buy the Season Pass uh, for $25. Um, I think there's... What is that? What are you? What do you do? You don't do anything yet. Whoa. They added a bunch of stuff. Oh man, this looks so good. It's it's almost worse um, going through a game that you've played before uh, because you expect certain things to happen. Like you walk into it saying, oh yeah, I know what's going to happen here and I know what's going to happen here and it's no big deal. I know what's going to... And then something different happens and you're just caught totally off guard and... You know, that's kind of unnerving, uh, that's kind of unnerving in its own right. Um, that was the poop log, in case you didn't read that. Uh, they track people's poops, apparently. I must have it removed. Um, yeah, they added a bunch of notes. Not a second passes by. Wow, that's cool. Uh, Alright, where the hell was the last button? The last button was, like, the one in the kitchen. Uh, the one over here. There we go, last button. Is there anything down here? There's gonna be another... Uh, there's gonna be another guy there, lead. Okay, so we're going to... Uh, no, nope, wrong way. And like I said, it's been a while, so while everything, uh, everything feels kind of familiar to me... Wait! Alright, this is one of my favorite parts. And this actually, uh, and I've, I've seen these guys at PAX, I've seen them at Fig, I've seen them demoing this game all over, and this... Section. It's one of my favorite sections. Let's see if this note's any different. This is one of my favorite sections to watch people playing on. And this is what I meant when I said like the the world kind of rotates. Uh, you'll see as we we pull out and then this giant wheel rotates. It's so cool. like it's so imaginative. Just things are flashing by. All right, I remember there's another note up here. 
here. Let me read that real quick. Come on. Faraday, please come out. It's been five years. Your brothers miss you. Uh, the longer you're in there, Faraday, the worse your punishment will be. What exactly are you doing in there? Yep, yeah, that's about right. Now they changed up some of the sounds, too. Man. Looks like we have a visitor. Looks like we have a clever one. Don't touch the lever. Oh, I didn't realize they came out behind me. Oh god. Alright, out. Out. This is uh, this is the release version of the game. So what you're seeing is the the, the full game. You know, I, we had a demo before, so we're looking we're looking at the full full game now. glimpse at the outside of the mansion. I just what to do. Uh, still 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 Excuse me. Right, this guy bolts, slams the door. So I don't quite know the distinction between like uh like which yeah you can see the inner mechanism is working. Uh I don't know if they're like different enemies, like the grandchildren all kind of act the same. Um so I haven't I haven't gotten super far in the game in the demo. Um Second. We are one family, and we are loved by our dear grandmother. This is different. And watch, for it hides in our very heart. This is different. We got something different. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Am I going the right way? Shit, which way am I supposed to go? So I can keep going down, I guess? Yeah. This is so cool. This is totally different from what I played last time. I just want to drink my tuna water and watch the bats. Why won't the boys leave me alone? Well, plenty of cans of tuna there. Okay. A lot of bats flying through. There, there, there are differences in every dusky land print. I know I've seen it. There's a code there. Each missing letter is a piece of the puzzle. Must keep looking to eat something. Need to eat something. Dusky land. Well, there's a pear right there. Uh, I mean, could have eaten something. There was food right there. I mean.
Okay, maybe this isn't the right way. Maybe this is the right way. Let's let's find out. I'm not 110% sure of where I'm going right now. All that oh, oh, all that previous confidence is now gone. Everything is different. Nothing is the same. I'm just scaling the outside of outside of the building now. It seems. Um, I guess we can go down there. Yeah, there we go. Alright. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. That's not a window I can climb into. Shit. Oh boy. Uh, uh, I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> I've been killed by my own stupidity. Alright, let's try this again. Try harder this time. I tried my best. Come on. Alright, there is a way over here. Oh, nope. Just kidding. Just kidding. Nope. Never mind. If it looks like it will kill you, it probably will. Alright. Good advice. Let's see, let's see, let's let's think this one through. Alright, this one's lit up. There's a thing over here. Can't open any of these windows, can we? Um, alright, so we came up here last time. Oh, there's stuff through that window. Okay, maybe that's the way we're supposed to go. Maybe? Nope. Oh, yep. Hey, there we go. Shit. And we can't just go about our everyday business. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh, okay. You have to understand me. Understand? There is a worm among us, hiding in our heart and home. Did you not hear, Cornelius? No bathing till we find the worm and bring it back downstairs. Where a worm belongs downstairs with the other worm. I hear another one over here. Somewhere, maybe? Disgusting! You're taking a hold and playing on a drum and I'm disgusting! Such a worthless creature, and look at the trouble it's causing us. We are told to sit still, to wait for it. Keep eyes and ears. Okay, I do not know which way I'm supposed to be going right now. Okay, 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 okay. Good, so I do know... Be sure Buck is contained if these four lights shine red. Oh, there's a guy right over there. Can I come in here? I can. What's, what's in here? What is this? Where am I? What is this? We finally caught that walking who calls himself Pyotr. The look on his face when he realized we could process him right here. No sedatives for this worm. We confiscated the blue matches. No one closes doors around here but us. He's been sent to the lockup to await ascension. The matches are in a safe place. Shit! Okay, so, I know that I need the matches. The matches, uh... <clears throat> the grandchildren hate the blue lights. Um, and so the matches light... Hello, bats. The matches light the the lamps that. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Which way are you going? 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 Okay. There we go. Uh, the matches light the blue lamps that that causes the grandchildren to run away. Um, <clears throat> Ok, 
Okay, alright. I know that I'm safe if I cross right back over to here. Uh, oh. There's a way down over here. What's over here? Is there anything over here? Did I just drop down and, like, maybe potentially kill myself again? Excuse me, bats. Uh, perhaps I did. Well, I might have just killed myself again. Um, oh. Damn it! I think I just killed myself again. Oh, so pro. Oh, I'm so pro. Whoa. Okay. Can they get up and over that thing? It looks like they can. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Uh, bad. Bad. <laughs> there is no need for this rash behavior. You're right. Okay, so we made some progress. Um, I think that's going to do it for this video. Um, I'm in a totally new place right now, so I really got to think through what the hell I'm doing now. Um, but don't worry, we're going to have more videos on this coming soon. I want a full playthrough of this game. It's one of my favorite horror games that I've played in a long, long time. Um, so thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you like this, make sure to like, comment, favorite, subscribe to our channel. For more Albino Lullaby and other survival horror games, uh, if you like comic books, make sure to check out the League of Ordinary Gentlemen podcast, link down in the description, uh, and make sure to check out Albino Lullaby on Steam coming soon, uh, or it's out already, depending on when this video goes up. Um, yeah, love this game, we're going to keep going with it. Alright, thanks again. Fucking jumping puzzles always get me.